kind and smote them until they came to Bethkar. And when Samuel took a stone and set it between Misfit and Shin, he called the name of the place Ebenezer, saying, Hitherto the Lord has helped us. So the Philistines were subdued and came no more into the land of Israel. The hand of the Lord was against the Philistines all the days of Samuel. And the cities which the Philistines had taken from Israel were restored unto Israel from Ekron unto Gath. And the coast thereof did Israel deliver out of the hand of the Philistines. There was peace between Israel and the Amorites. And Samuel judged all of Israel, or Samuel judged Israel all the days of his life. And he went from year to year in circuit to Bethel and Gilgal and Misfit and judged all of Israel in those places. And his return was to Ramoth, for there was his house, and there he judged Israel, and there he built an altar unto the Lord. Well, it didn't look so good that day. They were afraid. And if you'll read the, the verses before that, the chapters before that, one time the Philistines had even captured the Ark of the Covenant. And... Uh, it hadn't been all that good. It looked like they was on a losing streak. Anybody ever felt like you was on a losing streak? That everything that you'd done, you just come up short. But here, here, they got real serious with God. And the Bible said, He offered this burnt offering wholly, completely, entirely, totally unto God. He gave God His all. Uh, if you want to get the favor of the Lord and the face of the Lord and the mind of the Lord and the help of the Lord, then uh, you need to give God your all. If you, if you want a little bit of help, just give God a little bit of help. Amen. If you want a halfway, if you want a halfway deliverance, then give God your half. But if you want a God to take care of the problem, you got to give him your all. You can't reserve anything back wholly unto the Lord. And the Bible said, and the Lord heard it. And while Samuel was offering his all unto the Lord, they drew nigh. The Philistines were on their way. While they were on their way to conquer Israel again, the Lord thundered with a great thunder on that day on the Philistines. And discomfited them until and, 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 and Israel went out and pursued the Philistines and smote them. And so Samuel took a stone between Misfit and Shin and called the name of the place Ebenezer. We're going to have an Ebenezer service here tonight. Well, glory to God. Oh, yeah, we're going to have an Ebenezer service here tonight. And this is what Samuel said. Hitherto, the Lord has helped us. May not know what's going to happen tomorrow. But hitherto, right now, we've had a victory. They didn't realize, Brother Murphy, that... Uh, this is, this is going to be the last battle with the Philistines. Amen. Anybody in this house fought something long enough that you're ready to have that last battle? But they didn't know that. All they know was the Lord had helped them in this battle. And they said, Hitherto the Lord hath helped us. Hitherto hath the Lord helped us. Hitherto the Lord hath helped us. Well, I was born and raised in Kentucky. And uh, 
I don't never remember us using the word hitherto. They had thought you had, you was a foreigner from another land if you used hitherto. In Morton's Gap, Kentucky, there wasn't no hitherto folks there. But Brother Matt, what he's really saying, here's what he's really saying. He's saying, so far, so good. So far, so good. That's what I want to preach for a little while tonight, if the Lord help me. I want to preach on so far, I don't know what's going to happen tomorrow. But I plan on having an Ebenezer service in this house tonight. I am to praise the Lord for helping me for what all he's done. I believe if I'll do that, God will do for me just what he done for these uh, for the Israelites and drove the Philistines out of their land. Amen. Somebody needs to rear back and say, so far, so good. So far, so good. Turn around and tell two or three people there. So far. Well, will you pray with me? God, in the name of Jesus. Whoa, help me to help somebody in this service tonight, God. Lord, I felt led of your spirit to have this Ebenezer service tonight. Oh, don't know what I'm going to face tomorrow. Oh, but I can testify, Lord, up to this present time, you've been right there with me. You've never forsook me, but you've been right there. Well, glory to God, in Jesus' name, you may be seated. How come to tell somebody tonight that's got your back against the wall? And things don't look too good. God is telling you tonight. He wants somebody in this service tonight. To give him their all. Amen. Patty cake for Jesus. Won't get the job done. Just a little bit of lip service. Won't get the job done. Yeah, but if you want victory over your enemy. Amen. You, amen, you got to give him your all. You got to give him your everything. You got to pour everything out before God. Yeah, man. They brought that animal and they offered it holy. W-H-O-L-L-Y. They got it completely, entirely, absolutely. There it is, God. Hey, man, I'm giving it to you. I'm putting it on the altar. Hey, man, they said, you know, we're in trouble and we need the Lord to help us. Anybody ever been in so much trouble? They needed God to come on the scene. Oh, glory to God. Hey, man, not a, not a prayer that now I lay me down to sleep. I pray the Lord my soul to keep. And if I should die before I wake, I pray in the Lord. You know, them kind of prayers really don't move God. That kind of faith really don't move God. Ah, but if you got a desperate need, when you're at the end of your road, and there's nothing you can do, and it looks like the enemy is going to swallow you up and take you down, I'm going to tell somebody tonight, you need to give God your all. You need to give God your everything. You need to give God your entirety. And the Bible said, and the Lord heard it. Woo. We're not but a few days away from the anniversary of my wife's car wreck. I think it's on the third, wasn't it, baby? Was it the third? June the 8th. June, I know it's right in there. June the 8th. And, uh, uh, man, I'm going to tell you, we done been through it. Well, glory to God. We done been through it. And uh, got to that hospital. Her heart, heart was beating out of her chest. And uh, it didn't take a very smart guy to figure she's in bad trouble. Amen. I thank the Lord for the good doctors. I thank the Lord for everything that they did. But we needed help. We was at a great trauma center. But we needed help. 
Yeah, amen. You know what I've done? I've done what I've been doing. Amen. Ever since I've been 11 years old. Amen. I went to the one that's got it all in his hands. I don't care what the doctor says. I don't care what the surgeon says. There come some times in your life. Amen. That you got you to, hey, God. Amen. I ain't really gave you my all. Hey, but I, I'm facing something here, Lord. That I got to have. You know what? Amen. The Lord saw us through. They gave her less than 5% chance to live. And she sat in here tonight. Amen. Three years ago. Amen. She had this triple bypass. Amen. We made it through it. Amen. Then she had three strokes the following year. But here we are. You know what I'm saying? I'm saying, so far, so good. So far. Brother Drew, go, go, go bring me my drum. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. So far. So good. So far. So good. Don't know what we're facing tomorrow, but I come to tell God. So far. I'm not discouraged. I'm not down. So far. So good. Well, glory. Hallelujah. Come to give God my all. Glory to God. Hey, hey, hey. Come here, Brother Brad, and help me here. We're going to rejoice. Praise the Lord. Amen. Y'all seen poor Brother Brad? That we got. You talk about getting conflicting reports. We're in there, uh, in the waiting room, and the nurse comes out and says, "We want to see you in the consultation room." And they told us the surgery would be three hours. It had already been three hours. We hadn't heard a word from them. So this nurse comes in there. She meant well. She just got her wires crossed. She come in there and said, "Now you're." Your wife, she's still in surgery. She's doing good. She should be out by about noon. You should have seen the expression on his face. Because brother had told us three hours. It done been three hours. Now they was talking another three hours. And common sense will tell you, that ain't good. Ain't nothing good about that. And while we're walking out of there, I'm trying to think of something. I'm trying to think of something to say to him, but I'm going to tell you, it knocked the soup out of me. And uh, about that time, this woman come. well, the doctor wants to see you in this room in here. And, 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 and when we walked in there, and the doctor come in there, he said, she's out of surgery. Oh, boy, we just looked at each other. Said, 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 said she, she, she's out of surgery. And uh, 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 he started off like this. Said, now the cancer... Uh, was bigger than we thought it was. Well, that wasn't no good news. And, and, and the cancer was deeper than we thought it was. And uh, uh, said, uh, but you know, said, I feel like we got it all. And we, I don't think she's going to have any more problem out of it. And we saved 75% of her kidney. But now, that ain't the big thing. That, that ain't the big thing. Well, Brother Brad was telling him, said, well, now, she's been suffering a little on the other side, and that's got us concerned. And he said, well, that cancer wasn't hurting her. Is that what he said? Said, there's no nerves in there. Said, she couldn't have felt any pain in there. So we don't know what was hurting you. Who cares? We don't know. What, but whatever was hurting her, sent her to the hospital. And if she hadn't been hurting, she wouldn't have went. And that cancer could have went all the way through both kidneys and in her body. Because it's a sign. Well, praise the Lord. But you know what? <laughs> Woo! Brother Brad. So far. So far. So far. So far. Hey, hey. So far. Yes. 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 Help me.
me a little bit. So far, so good. So far, so good. So far, so good. Woo! Hey! Oh, kataba shataba katabahaya. Touch your child tonight. Heal this condition right now. Heal up, 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 higher. So far. So far. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Hey. Glory. Hey. Boy, your mama's home with you. Won't be long. Amen. She'll be frying kick, frying bacon and frying taters. Amen. And be even back up running full stream. God's good. God's good. Yeah, get back hell. So far. So far. So far. Woo! So far. So good. So far, you may be seated. Sister Tripta called me this morning. She couldn't hardly talk. She was weeping, crying so hard. She said, uh, they've called me, and Steve passed out or wouldn't come to, and uh, don't exactly know what all it was. And, and now she said, he come to enough to sit Call for the ambulance, and and here she's here, and he's there. And her knowing his heart condition, and uh, I told her, I said, "Let's pray right now." Woo! Thank you, Jesus. Yeah, the old song said, "Jesus on the main line." Tell him what you want. If you want your body, tell him what you want. Mama started praying, and the preacher started praying. Oh, glory to God. Hey, glory to God. You know what we were saying so far? So good. So far. So good. So far. So good. Hey, so far. Glory to God. Hey. Praise God. Get back, devil. Get back, hell. Get back, doubt. Get back, unbelief. Whoa. Hey. If you would have read the history, you read the book of Samuel. It's ups and downs and ups and downs. And sometimes it's more downs than it is up. How many's tired of having more downs than you got up? Anybody here tired of having more downs than you've got up? Well, praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Hey, and Brother Tory, you and Brother Brando, come here and help me just a minute. Glory to God. Glory to God. Hey. Hey. Yes. Yes. They diagnosed cancer on their mother. And I can tell you, there wouldn't be no scary thought like that. Good, godly mother. Praying mama. Mama that's full of faith. Well, praise the Lord. She didn't cry the blues. She didn't fall into deep depression. You know what she done? She said, I'm going to offer the Lord my all. Yes! 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 Glory. Hallelujah. 
Look at her sitting back there tonight. Woo! Getting a new head of hair. Well, glory to God. Getting her straight back. Get back, devil. So far. Hey, boys. Let's, so far. So far. So good. So far. So good. Hey, 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 hey. So far. So good. Why don't you guys take a lap around here for your mama? Glory to God. Woo, hallelujah. Hey, yes, yes, yes. Yeah, yes. Yes. Yeah. So far. So far. So good. Glory, you can be seated. Woo. Sister Smith got sick the first of the year. And she just kept going down. I don't think they've ever really figured all of it out. But boy, I mean, Brother Smith, it didn't look good, did it? You know, we done it. They went everywhere and everything they could do. But Sister Smith's a praying woman. She's a woman of faith. <laughs> Woo! <Amen>. Hey! <laughs> Over all the way to Mayo Brothers, they done a little bit. Amen. But here she's sitting in church tonight. Got a good cutter about her. Getting her strength back. As soon as she gets feeling a little better, hey, my Brother Smith's going to load her up in that motor home. Amen. Travel the world. Praise God. Amen. Hey, well, glory to God. Hey, boys, your grandma's, your grandma's still alive. We could have buried your grandma, but your grandma's, are y'all happy about that? Are you young ladies happy about that? That you got your grandma in church with you tonight? Hey, man, why don't you take a lick on that a little bit? So far, we're having an Ebenezer service. So far, so good, so far, hey, hey, so good, yeah, call your mother, yeah, 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 so far, hey, 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 woo, yes, so far, hey, 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 so good. Now we got people on this side of that. We got people on this side of the hitherto. But the Lord wanted me to have an Ebenezer service tonight. You tired of fighting the same battle? I'm not trying to psych you up tonight. I'm just telling you, it'll work. God can work for you. Amen. I don't want to embarrass him. But Brother Stevens, can I pray for you? I'd like to pray for you. Why don't you hand that baby to you, to your other half? We're going to pray for you tonight. <laughs> Woo! Kala mo shata la la ba kala ba ya. I'm gonna pray for you tonight. I'm gonna tell you, things are getting ready to change in your life. <laughs> oh yes. Anybody got faith? Any of you brother got faith? You join with me tonight? Come up here and I'm getting ready to lay hands on him. God's getting ready to deliver him. Yes! This is an Ebenezer. Sir. Oh, yes! I feel those chains of falling. I feel those chains of falling. 
Oh, restore him right now, Lord. Glory. Glory. Oh, Come on, folks. So far. There is power. Jesus. Jesus name there is power <laughs> in the name yes 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 there is power in the name of Jesus 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 name to break every chain every chain break every chain every chain break every chain oh yes yes yeah. to break every chain Yes, yes, yes. Oh, yes, oh, yes. There Come on. Power in the name you need something from the Lord tonight. Reach out for it. There is power Jesus. in the name of Jesus. Hey, hey. 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 Hey, to break every chain. Jesus name. Break every chain. Jesus name. Break every chain. Jesus name. Break every chain. Break every chain. Minister, heal it. Right now, God. Heal this condition. Whoa. Let virtue flow through her body. Even now. Jesus name. Rising up. Sis, let the Lord touch you tonight. Yeah, yeah, yeah. To break every chain. 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 Jesus. Yeah. I hear the chains falling. Jesus' name. I hear the chains oh, yeah. falling. Oh, every bit of it. Every bit of it. In the name of Jesus. All of it, God. All of it, Lord. There is power. In the name of Jesus, oh, Lord. there is power in the name of Jesus to break every chain. I wish some faith would spring in somebody's heart tonight. You raise your hand and say, so far, so good. Hitherto the Lord has helped us. So far, so good. Oh, Jesus. Break every chain, break every chain, break every chain. There is power in the name of Jesus. chain break every chain break every chain break every chain break every chain amen brother jared i want you and natalie come we gonna i'm gonna pray with y'all tonight glory to god they have a special need but god's able to take care of them we're going to have an Ebenezer service tonight. 
There is power in the name of Jesus. There is power in the name of Jesus. There is power in the name of Jesus to break every chain, break every chain. Break every chain to break every chain, break every chain, break every chain. There is power in the name of Jesus. There is power in the name of Jesus. There is power. Jesus to break every chain, break every chain, break every chain, to break every chain, break every chain, break every chain. I hear the chains falling. I hear the chains falling. chains falling I hear the chains falling there is power in the name of Jesus there is power in the name of Jesus of Jesus. Oh, Lord Jesus. Believe in you, Lord. We're getting ready for baptism. We're going to baptize Brother Riley tonight. Amen. Glory to God. I'm going to baptize Brother Riley tonight. I want everybody that's going to go on that trip to come up here. We want to pray over you. The Lord give you safety. Amen. It's a long ways. Ask for the Lord's help if you're going to go. Amen. Let's, let, amen. Let's pray that the Lord would, would, would give them safety. Amen. All right, let's pray, saints. God, in the name of Jesus, be with them on this trip. Keep them safe from accident and danger, Lord. Protect them, Lord. Let the angel of the Lord encamp round about them. Do it, God, in Jesus' name. Don't let any misfortune take place. Dear God, in Jesus' name. Glory to God. You may return back to your places of worship while they're getting ready to baptize Brother Riley and the only name given under heaven whereby men can be saved. Amen. I'm glad when I went down, I went down in the name of Jesus. How about you? Glory to God. Praise God. Amen. Thank you, Lord. Shall be light in the evening time. Way the glory you will surely find. It's a waterway. Is a light today. Baptized in Jesus' name. Young and old, repent of all your sins. Holy Ghost will enter in. For the evening time has come. Evening time has come. It is a fact that God and Christ are one. It shall be light in the evening time. Way to glory you will surely find. It's a waterway. It's a light today. 